Welcome to Dish by Illy. This is Illy, by the way. Okay, so I watched a couple of videos and we captured it in my reaction video of me watching people make pancake cereal. I don't know why I found it really fascinating and because I am gluten intolerant, I thought I'll give this a little bit of a go using gluten-free flour to make mini pancakes, which then I will eat in a bowl and act like a cereal. So, Let's get cooking! The first thing we need to do is obviously make our pancake batter. So I'm using gluten-free baking flour because we can get that here in Malaysia. 125 grams. And we need about 2 tablespoons of brown sugar. Okay. So I'm using coconut milk. Perfect. And I'm going to add in a splash of vanilla. Oh, it smells so good. And I'm also going to crack in one egg. <laughs> Maybe my measuring cup is a little bit too small. <laughs> kind of mix this together. But before we do that, maybe I should just add a little bit of this mixture <laughs> into my flour and then mix it up. Pour that in. And you don't want to over mix your batter either. That's why I'm just using a fork here. Okay. So once that's all incorporated, your batter is kind of done. And like I said, just mix it up until you don't see any big lumps. If there's little, little lumps, that's fine. And uh, get yourself a glass. Put your piping bag in. And what we want to do is just pour your mixture. Pour your mixture in. Now you want to tie a knot <laughs> because this batter is going to go everywhere. Actually, you can also double bag it. Um, to avoid it from breaking, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. So the inner piping bag needs to be needs to be cut the smallest possible hole that you can ever imagine. Okay, cannot be too big, and this is the reason why. Because when you start dripping it. You want to be able to control it. They look like mini cereals. Oh wow! Check that out! So once they start bubbling, you can actually flip them over. And then you just want to cook them until they're nice and golden brown, I guess. Okay, so I guess that's one tablespoon worth of cereal pancake. <laughs> okay, so we're going to be here until tomorrow. So come back <laughs> until we reach the end, guys. <laughs> Eight hours later. <laughs> All of that, and we only just probably have enough pancake cereal to feed like maybe two people, maybe one person even. Jeez. Let's drizzle some honey. You can actually have this with maple syrup as well if you like. That's what I've seen the kids do. Some plant based milk. How's it look? It's not bad, isn't it? Bon appetito! <laughs> I mean... It's alright I guess, but it doesn't taste like cereal. It tastes like eating pancake with milk. <laughs> oh dear god. If you want to see me try... 
other trending foods, please comment below. I'll be happy to just give it a go. And don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification button. We'll see you guys soon. No, I'm, I'm not eating this one. <laughs> Come on, Kelly. Come on, try it. It's weird. <laughs> it's so weird. I'd rather just eat it on its own. <laughs>